watching Maine's Total Weather and News. I'm Tracy Sable. And I'm Steve Minnick. Asylum seekers in Lewiston will no longer receive general assistance. The city council approved that change, which goes into effect on Wednesday. Right now, the mayor says the council is in the process of deciding how long current asylum seekers on general assistance will be able to stay on the program. Mayor McDonald says he wants the group to be able to work in his city, but that the number of asylum seekers coming to Lewiston is growing by the day. I'll stay pleased. Continue to warn people in the Parkman area about the manhunt for murder suspect Robert Burton. Police have put these signs up in five nearby towns. Police want people in the area to be alert and to report any suspicious activity immediately. Investigators will provide an update on the search Thursday afternoon. An Augusta man will spend the next seven years in prison after his ninth drunk driving conviction. A judge sentencing Peter DeBoard this morning. DeBoard told the jury at his April trial that he had waited long enough to drive. However, he had a blood alcohol content of more than double the legal limit. DeBoard served nine months in jail for his eighth conviction back in 2007. And thank you for joining us for this News 8 web update. And make sure you check back at WMTW.com on our mobile app for the top stories and weather anytime. Have a great evening.